in today's video i'm going to talk about something called as ankle foot orthosis what is this well ankle foot orthosis is nothing but an brace or let's say an orthotic device which has to be worn on the legs for a cp joint made up of either from plastic and aims to provide good amount of strength to leg and foot muscles. The main function of this particular product is to help maintain the foot of a cerebral palsy child or I'll say spastic diplegic child in neutral position in terms of ankle and foot. Many a times you must have observed in spastic diplegic child tends to keep the leg in a plantar flexion position something like this where he tends to walk on the tip of the toes now this is not an ideal position for walking since the base of support gets lower down there are much more increased chances of fall hence ankle foot orthosis puts or I'll say keeps the leg in corrected position which is you can say completely stable position helping the child to walk in a better way even though ankle foot orthosis is used very widely in cerebral palsy cases it's equally widely used for other neurological disorders like stroke spinal cord injury traumatic brain injury etc but today's video we would be talking in terms of cerebral palsy there are two basic function or its use of this ankle foot orthosis. It acts as an aid for assistance to allow the child to walk independently to an extent. And the second thing, it helps in preventing the contracture that develops secondary to spasticity or else increase in the muscle tightness. It also maintains ankle and foot in a corrected position. Now, what are the benefits of ankle foot orthosis? There are huge amount of benefits of ankle foot orthosis and some are listed here. First, it provides stable base of support, hence helping in walking. It improves the walking ability of the child, it minimizes the effect of spasticity, it enables the child to take repeatable steps many a times when spasticity exists child tend to bend the legs while walking much more often hence with the weight of ankle foot orthosis and correct alignment of ankle foot orthosis it enables the child to take the repeatable steps of walking much more easier it also reduces the level of energy that a child needs to spend while the process of walking it aids the child in transition from sitting to standing definitely when a child is having spasticity and the child is having in plant fiction gait it he or she will find very difficult to transit from sitting to standing at that time a stable base of support provided by ankle foot orthosis enables the child to perform this movement in a much more easier way it reduces the amount of missed steps it strengthens the weak muscles to an extent it controls the muscle imbalance and Last but not least, it helps in prevention of the deformity that develops following contraction or else muscle tightness. Now, you can buy ankle foot orthosis either ready-made or else custom-made. But I would highly recommend if your child is having cerebral palsy or else spastic diplegia, go for a custom-made one because the custom-made one is totally designed based on the child's foot shape. Hence. The design comes much more adaptable to your child's abilities and gives better result. Assessment is very important before deciding on ankle foot orthosis. An orthotist is a person who assesses a child and makes this custom made ankle foot orthosis. The assessment is always done in collaboration with physiotherapist. Hence, if you are planning to buy an ankle foot orthosis for your child, make sure to take an appointment with orthotist and at the same time with physiotherapist. Let them plan together to design a custom-made ankle foot orthosis for your child. Now, definitely there are some precautions that you should keep in mind while your child is wearing ankle foot orthosis. What are these precautions? First, inspect your child at the same time the ankle foot orthosis before wearing. Look for stress, cracks or anywhere where there is some loosening of the joint. This might damage the child's leg area or it'll sometimes skin. Make sure the straps are secured well before child attempts to walk or do any activity with the help of ankle foot orthosis. If an ankle foot orthosis is having a hinge, make sure it's moving smooth and do not make any kind of noise. Remove the ankle foot orthosis immediately if child complains of tightness, tingling numbness or anywhere pain 
in the area where a child is wearing ankle foot orthosis. This is a sign of either the ankle foot orthosis is too tight or is not worn correctly or else somewhere there is damage in the product itself. So friends, this was an introduction about ankle foot orthosis. There are huge varieties of ankle foot orthosis available in the market. Not only ankle foot orthosis, there is knee ankle foot orthosis, hip knee ankle foot orthosis, trunk hip knee ankle foot orthosis. There are many varieties of orthosis available that helps your child to be mobile and independent. Make sure to discuss about this orthotic devices with your physiotherapist and decide on the best one for your child. I hope your child lives a very healthy life. On that note, I will end this video here. Make sure to like this video, share this video with your friends and family members and do not forget to subscribe to our Health Q channel. See you in the next video. Bye-bye.